So Throughlight has sent me uh, another torch for you to have a look at, or for me to at least show you. So it's the Throughlight TN12 Pro R. It's a cool white, and it's the new, it's the new um, torch. Um, it comes in this little brown box, which is great because I hate big fancy packaging. So you get this little brown box and some goodies inside of it. Uh, inside the box you get the torch, which is there. Uh, you also get a pouch to keep your torch in. You get a lanyard, really nice lanyard. Uh, you get a clip, uh, a belt clip, buckle clip to go on to the side. You also get some spare O-rings, which are water seals, and you get a small flap to go over the USB-C socket. And there's a little white clear plastic thing inside this pouch, and I'm not quite sure what that's for. So um, if I find out in the meantime, I'll, um, yeah, I'll, I'll come up and let you know. So I've got some stuff up on the screen in front of me as well to tell you uh, a little bit about it as and when we sort of go through the specs on this. But there he is, or well, there she is. Uh, there's your tactical torch. It fits in the palm of my hand quite nicely. Um, it's about five inches long. Uh, I can probably tell you the size of it. It is 131 centimeters, so just over five inches long. Um, it's got a button on the back, big rubber button, if you excuse this flappy tag, uh, it's basically a warning telling you to do the bottom up and the top up before you start charging it and to charge it up full. Uh, on, the, on the subject of charging, there's a small tiny little LED light in there. Uh, when you plug it in and it's charging, it's red. Uh, I think it goes green when it's fully charged and then when you actually got the torch on, uh, when you press and turn the torch on, this goes blue uh, so you can see the light. Uh, yeah, it's a nice little grip. It's uh, an alloy, metal, good and strong, good and solid. Um, it's got a nice knurly grip on it. And it's got a nice bezel on the front as well to protect the glass at the front. And the, the lens looks really, really clear on the front. And there you get a really good, clear, shiny lens on that. It sort of magnifies a little bit as well as I'm looking into the end. On the bottom, you've got a rubber button. This is your tactical button. This is your one-click button to turn it on to a full power. Um, I think that turns, turns a turbo on. And the turbo now is 1,900 lumens, which is pretty pokey for a little torch like this. Inside here there's a battery, you unscrew the bottom, you don't need to take it out. Um, your battery is there, it's a 3400 milliamp battery, it's uh, 3.6 volts and it's a number 18650 if you're interested and it comes supplied with that in the end and all you're going to do is make sure that it's done up tight and your o-rings are inside there which is why you get the spare ones for to keep it waterproof. Right, so turn this thing on, you have to make sure it's unlocked. And first of all, you get the little Firefly light. Um, they call it a Firefly because it's a very, very dim little light. So you basically press and hold the button when you switch it on and you get this Firefly light. So you press, keep your finger on it. That's number one, sorry. Let's try again. Keep your finger on it. And there you go, this little Firefly. That is half a lumen. That will actually stay like that for about 75 days. When you turn that off, press it once and you get the next light. Quite a powerful little light. Um, it scrolls through three lights. This is the dimmest, which is about 50 lumens. Uh, should run like that for 46 hours. So if you want a torch for nighttime and you're going camping or you're walking or you're hiking and stuff like that, 46 hours with that is a long, a long, long time. Then what you do is you press and hold it and it goes up to the next brightness. That is 220 lumens. That'll run like that for nine hours. So, you know, if you're walking, and you're on a you know on a path on a bit of a dark area and you need to sort of light your way when you're going along uh nine hours is going to give you plenty of light pretty much all through the dark you know all through the night time uh to get you a whole night's worth of light like i say the little blue light is on there you can see a little blue light now because i'm actually using it and you press and hold it again so one two three and that goes up to 550 lumens. That will run like that for another two and a half hours. So again, a really, really, really bright light. Uh, very, very powerful. It's got a real intense beam on it. As you can see there, it's got quite an intense beam on it and uh, it's gonna give you quite a good distance. In fact, the throw distance in maximum, I can probably give you the throw distance. It is 380 meters. That is a long, long way. Um, and that's in high power. So high power mode, you have to hit the button twice. So I'm gonna go back down to the lower setting because when I turn it off and turn it back on, go on, on again, it comes back to the lower setting, just saves me blinding myself a little bit. Um, then if I go up to the turbo mode, which is a double press on the button on the side, turbo mode, that is massive. That is super, super bright. 
Uh, that's 1,900 lumens. That is going to light the whole, well, I can see the, it's lighting the whole house as I look down the corridor. Um, this is a very, very powerful light at 1,900 lumens. It will stay like that for seven minutes and then it will drop down to 477 lumens because I can feel the temperature in that. It's getting really, really hot. Um, so, you know, that's the problem with them. They get so hot when they're maximum power and they're maxed out. Uh, so, yeah, it will drop down to 450, 477 lumens and then that will give you enough light then to keep going and that will run for another 130 minutes. So you've got a lot of power, a lot of light, um, to go looking, it's a tactical torch as well, it's classed as a tactical torch. It's got a USB socket on the side with a little rubber cover over it which makes it waterproof. It's actually IPX8 waterproof to two meters. Um, so it means you can drop this in water and it's going to be fine. If you're using it out in the rain, it's going to be fine. If you, if, you know, if you go swimming with it, as long as you don't go down too deep, it will be fine in your pocket. Um, it's drop resistant, impact resistant for 1.5 meters, which means you know you can carry this around if it gets banged and banged. You know, got it on your camera bag, on your strap, or on your belt, and it gets knocked and banged, it will withstand a bit of impact. Uh, 1.5 meters is a clear drop. Um, at 220 lumens, I said it would run for nine hours. Um, so yeah, really good a length of time for, for operating. Uh, it's got a smooth reflector. I think you'll find that's what this is inside. It's a smooth reflector. So basically it gives out a lot of light. If I put this onto this, the low setting, you can just see in there, you know, there's a, a good visual clear lens at the end of that. Um, can't give you any more specs. There's not much else I can tell you apart from it's 27 millimeters at its widest point and 25 at its narrowest point. And it weighs about 85 grams that's battery included uh, battery excluded 85 grams so with a battery in it you're getting slightly more um, surface so yeah that's all i wanted to do really show you this new little torch from through uh, the t12 pro um, really really nice really really powerful and a good you know a good handful and a good grip now why i'm here for watching this they've also sent me two little tiny mini torches these are uh, a mini through night ti2 they're brand new these are their new little version they're both in green one of them i've opened just literally so i can show you what it looks like um, and the other one is still sealed so there she is little tiny mini little light like that it takes a little triple a battery great thing for keeping on your key rings or on your camera bag or something if you want to look at the top of the camera um, yeah, you get enough power just to be able to see the top of the camera and it probably tells me what the output is on these but it's in very very small writing but I can't even no I can't see anything written on the screen and I'm not going to go looking uh, on the screen for it but they're only little tiny dim ones just something to keep on your keychain um, I keep a little tiny one on my keychain all the time then if I need to get into the car I need to get into the van or I'm looking for something when I drop it when I'm out on my camera bag and stuff like that, I can find it so these are really really handy if you want one of these drop me a comment let me know why you want one and uh, we'll do a random pick and I'll pick two uh, winners and I'll get them both posted off to you um, so if you're interested in one of these please let me know why you want it and uh, what you're going to do with it okay so that's all I want to do. Thanks to Throughlight for sending me the next torch out. Uh, look forward to seeing the next one they've got. Uh, brand new, very, very powerful, 1,900 lumens. Check it out online. I'll leave the description below uh, to take you to their website. And oh yeah, it retails at, it retails at $49.99. Okay, $49.99. Um, but yeah, cracking little torch, really, really like it. Oh, there's one other thing, there's one other thing it's got. And if you're into, if you don't like flashing lights, turn off now triple press you get a strobe okay really good tactical feature if he's got a strobe on there someone's coming to attack you and stuff like that whack the strobe on in their face and it's going to really put you off for a little while okay uh, you open your eyes again if you're okay with flashing lights they're gone now so thanks again for through light till next time ciao for now don't forget like and subscribe give us that thumbs up and if you want to see more torches i'll leave a link on the end page for any other torches that i've done ciao bye bye